Hi, can you spray paint farrow and bore water-based paint? Yes you can. I've done a quick video here just to explain how it's done. I've used estate eggshell as you can see. I've used this spray gun. The spray gun I've used is an SSG 501 that's made by Sealy, ever such a cheap spray gun. You need to use this kind of gun because the paint's very thick and it won't come out of a conventional spray gun. This model comes with a 2.2 air cap, which if you were pa uh, painting cars, it would be absolutely no good whatsoever because it would just gush out all over the floor. I've applied two coats. What you do find with this paint is sometimes it takes a long time to go off, uh, especially if it's quite a cold climate. Um, it's quite warm at the moment in the summer, so this isn't too much of an issue at the moment. I put the first coat on yesterday, and didn't do any particular method to spray in it, just blasted it on, made sure I got it on nice and even without it running off everywhere. Uh, I put it over the top of a water-based primer. The water-based primer, I put about two or three coats on, let that thoroughly dry, rubbed it down with 320 paper, applied one coat of farrow and bore paint, left it to dry for probably about getting on for 20 hours, and now I've applied the second and final coat, as you can see, absolutely lovely even finish. Um, done quite a few doors, complete kitchen here. This is about the fifth time I've used it. Really impressed, not a problem. The only thing I will say is it's probably going to be too thick straight out of the pot, so I advise you mix about 30% water to the paint. It seems to come out quite nice with 30%. Uh, occasionally the viscosity may change from can to can so possibly worth trying it with say 20 to start with if you're happy with that then leave it if not just go to the 30% I've used 30% and it's come out really well thank you